Hi everyone, my name is David Andre and I am the middle school social studies teacher and eighth grade ELA literature teacher here at St. Bernard Catholic School. For my sixth graders, we are studying ancient civilization and we'll be starting with the Paleolithic era and ending around late Roman Empire. Um, do a lot of fun things from projects to writing assignments just to your standard uh, so history tests. Seventh grade is Washington State history. Once again, projects, tests, and a, a lot of fun for uh, for that class as well. Eighth grade, we do uh, excuse me, U.S. history, starting with European arrival in the 15th century and ending around kind of the modern era, so about middle of the 20th century. Once again, we're going to be doing presentations, writing papers, and studying for tests. That's it's our main vehicles um, here at St. Brendan within the social studies program. For literature, we do a fair amount of reading. We just finished uh, The Giver and recently started Outsiders. We'll also get Fahrenheit 451 and Animal Farm and probably a few others. Um, ELA is really preparing these kids for high school. So that means teaching them how to be concise, strong writers. Um, a lot of one to two page papers on a plethora of topics. And that's really going to be our focus within our ELA program, along with a pretty involved Greek and Latin um, kind of foundational system just to learn words, where they come from. And uh, we'll do that as well. Someone who's looking at St. Brendan, um, it, it, there's, there's a lot of, of positives from the small classrooms. I think the biggest class is around 20 to 24 students, dedicated staff from Mrs. Shoemate to the front office. They're all wonderful and will do whatever they can to help families and students reach the highest potential. Um, it's a very intimate, close-knit community here and uh, most kids, you know, Kids that come here thrive just because of the, the ability to get the help they need. Um, it's also a very liturgically driven school as well. We go to mass every Friday and each day starts and ends with a prayer along with the Angelus prayer at, at noon that we do. We have a Christmas concert. We do um, the Advent wreath. We will do things in the spring for Easter. Um, it is not only an incredible academic institution, but it is a place where the spiritual health of the student is taken very seriously. And we do not um, disregard that. We think that is part of the development of the students here. I hope you guys will check out St. Brendan. We have uh, different ways available, either virtual or in person. And any questions you have, please uh, give the school a call. Take care.